Jury selection will begin in a high profile murder case out of Massachusetts. So this case has garnered so much attention. The judge has ordered a buffer zone around the courthouse because of it. Kristen Brunell is live in studio this morning with the latest. Good morning, Kristen. Good morning, Kate and Patrick. 43 year old Karen Reed of Mansfield is charged with second degree murder in the 2022 death of her Boston police officer boyfriend, John O'Keefe. Reed is accused of hitting O'Keefe with her car outside of a friend's home in Canton during a snowstorm in January 2022. Prosecutors say that the couple had been drinking that night. Meanwhile, Reed's defense says she is the victim of a cover up. They believe that O'Keefe was beaten inside the home, bitten by a dog, and left outside. Reed's supporters have gained a as they have often demonstrated outside the courthouse, many wearing clothing and messages about the case into the courtroom. The judge has since issued an order prohibiting these types of demonstrations from happening within 200 feet of the courthouse during the trial. Legal experts believe finding an impartial jury will be difficult. We won't find jurors that never heard of this case, perhaps, but hopefully we will find jurors who have an open mind. Reed has pleaded not guilty to charges, including second degree murder. Now coming up in the next half hour, how the controversial case is having an impact on the people who live in the town of Canton. In studio, Kristen Burnell, 12 News. Latest now on the Karen Reed murder case out of Massachusetts. Jury selection is scheduled to begin today in a Dedham courtroom. And new this morning, Kristen Burnell joins us live in studio with how this high profile case is having an impact on the people of Canton, Mass, the town where prosecutors say Reed's boyfriend, John O'Keefe, was killed. Well, the case has gained national attention and law ex experts believe that it will be difficult to find an impartial jury. Now, Canton residents say that the case has created such tension throughout the town. Many can't even speak about the trial with with their own neighbors. It's been crazy. It's been difficult. Everybody wants to see this get started and see what comes out. And as we mentioned, the case has gained national attention with dozens of Reed supporters showing up at the courthouse wearing clothing with messages about the case. Reed is charged with second degree murder for the death of her boyfriend, John O'Keefe, back in January 2022. O'Keefe was also a Boston police officer. Prosecutors claim she hit him with her car and left him for dead in a snowstorm. Meanwhile, her defense says she is the victim of a cover up. They believe that O'Keefe was beaten inside the home, bitten by a dog and left outside. The, the judge has also ordered a 200 foot buffer zone around the courthouse, as well as restrictions on megaphones and clothing to shield jurors from anyone outside who might influence them throughout the trial. Live in studio, Kristen Brunell, 12 News.